Thanks for coming back for another episode of Raspberries Balloons. I think today, since I'm kind of in the oceany mood, we can do a fancy mermaid. Yay! All right, so I'm kind of traditional, so I think that this time we are going to do the mermaid with a green tail. All right. So we want to blow up the first tail balloon, so it's about four fingers on the end, and then we will get a second color of green, a dark green this time. So we have spring green and dark green. And again, we need four fingers on the end. Now I like to start both of these, when both of these green balloons with pinch twists. <clears throat> but I use a lot of pinch twists, so I'm sure you understood, knew that. <laughs> All right, and then we twist those two pinch twists together. So now our green balloons are stuck. All right, now we need a four finger flower petal on one side, and then a four finger flower petal on the other side. And we'll twist those together. All right, now this is a crazy fancy one. So we're gonna take the two balloons and we're just gonna kind of hold them in place with the bottoms of my hands and twirl them with the top of my hands. we just keep twirling and twirling. All right. Now once it gets pretty long, we should, I don't know how long that is. About four hands, four fingers times four. <laughs> so about 16 fingers long. We want to take this and wrap it back in. All right, and do the same thing on the other side. And we have a little bit extra on this side. So we'll make a little bubble there. And we'll wrap that in. And then we'll wrap the bubble in through the flower petal. And then we're going to do it so about four fingers in from one side. We're going to twist that. We're going to pinch it there and then twist. And again on the other side. So about four fingers in, we're going to pinch it. So pinch it here and then just twist the bottom. And then that should give us a mermaid tail look. Perfect. Okay, and then we need a skin tone. I'm using blush, but you can use mocha or even pink or blue or whatever colors you'd like. All right, and now I like to give it a pinch twist to start. Okay, I give it two pinch twists to start. And then I'm gonna give it about four fingers, maybe six fingers, for a little arm. Then I give it another pinch twist. And a second pinch twist. All right, so that's gonna act like the neck, and then we have an arm and a little hand. All right, and then I like to go down about seven fingers for the body, and wrap that into the tail, into the top of the tail with the little pinch, with the little flower petal, not the big ones. And then we'll come back up and wrap that into the neck. And then we'll give her four fingers and another bubble for a pinch twist. And another bubble for a pinch twist. All right, we can get rid of this. It's all gone. And wrap that in. Perfect. Now for the head, I like to use a six inch quickly. And I blow it up, not quite all the way, just until we get to about my knuckles there, from the bottom of my hand. Now I like these ones because they make it easier to attach the hair up at the top. And I like Ariel, so we're going to go with a red hair.
tie that off. And we have about four fingers at the bottom. Okay, so I'm going to do about seven fingers and then do a pinch twist. Just like that. And then we're going to tie the top of our quick link into that pinch twist. Just like that. And then we'll have the hair come down all the way into that neck pinch twist. And then all the way back up to the hair pinch twist. And we'll go all the way back down. All the way back up. All right. And then we're going to take this, pull it through this hair, so the knots like this. And then we'll tie it back up into the pinch twist. And then we can get rid of the rest of that hair. And hide it. So we kind of have that bang effect that Ariel has now. Whoosh! Alright, we're going to need another red balloon. Perfect. This one is just a little bigger, so it's six fingers at the end. All right, wrap that into the pinch twist at the top. Bring it down around her face. Wrap it into the pinch twist around the neck. And then we're going to twirl this just like with the tail. Now it's like your hair is in a braid. And now we need a purple. Okay, so. For this part, I blow up the balloon, but really all we need is about four fingers. And then we tie it off on both sides. And then we wrap it around the front and then to the back and just tie it. I just do a double knot. And then if you have scissors on you, you can just cut those off. Sometimes I just like to hide it in the back. Perfect. Now she's got her seashells. Now we just need the artwork. So we're going to go one eye, two eyes, cute little nose, some eyebrows, and would it be Ariel with her red lips? Perfect. Now if you want, you can even give her blue eyes and stuff, just like the real Ariel. Well, I think that's it guys. Thanks for watching.